we'll finally be back doing a movie preview show. Fine. What's wrong, Murph? What clawed up your back cheeks? The fact that January's coming. What's wrong with January? Nothing, just we have to come back and do another bump show. What, you don't like the month shows? They've sort of lost their funniness over the last few months. Well, if they've lost their funniness, maybe that means you lost your funniness. Because people think, I'm funny, I mean I have good looks, I have charm. What do you have? Good looks, charm. Well, why don't you like doing these? I don't know, I, just, I guess I just lost the spark. But we still do them. You like doing your reviews. Yeah, because those are successful and those are really good. Well, let's just get through the movies. Well, the first movie of January, January 4th, is One Miss Call. You know, it's that movie kind of like The Ring. When, the, you know, then it's a remake of that Chinese or Japanese movie. When those people get a call and they pick up the phone, it's like, and if they miss it, then the, the cell phone kills them. Yeah. You know that one? What? Do they purposely make that like the ring? Yes, because, you know, once you have something that's successful, you copy it again and again and again, as many times as you can, to keep making money. That's the way Hollywood does things. Like after The Matrix came out, where they, all those action movies copied it? Yeah. And, you know, they're not the Vervinsky's brothers anymore. One of them became a woman, so they're the Vervinsky uh, siblings. Well, what difference does that make? But you don't call them brothers if one had this exchange operation. That means they're Vrinsky siblings. On just January 11th is 27 dresses. How many pairs of dresses do you have? Five. A normal heterosexual male would say none. Um, and then there's the first Sunday. The first Sunday of the month is when people hunt for Easter eggs. And then there's another one called In the Name of the King, A Dungeon Siege Tale. What do you think that's about? I had the faintest clue. Remember that movie Under Siege? You know, when they go explore, you know, they shrink and go on someone's butt and they're under siege. Get it? The guy's name Siege. They're under siege. I never saw it. Well, there's also the Pirates Who Don't Do Anything, a Veggie Tales movie. I'm so excited to see vegetables on screen acting crazy. I love vegetables. <laughs> what do you think about it? I'll see it. Looks more interesting than the next Da Vinci Code. And then there's this one, Taxi to the Dark Side. Is that like Tales from the Dark Side? Could be, only in a taxi. Yeah, and then January 18th is that movie, you know, shot with a camcorder. You know, Independence Day style. <laughs> my pubes. You see my pubes on camera? My pubes. You see my pubes? Look, it's an alien. Holy shit. It's a fucking alien. Did you get on camera? Did you get on camera? Cloverfield. Hmm. Originally, I didn't even think it had a title. And there's that movie. With Julia, Louis, Louis Tripus, me and money, I think. Who's that again? You know, the one from Troll, who was the one that... Oh, from Seinfeld? No. And then there's, um, on January 25th, it's four months, three week, weeks, and two days. The exact amount of time... It's been since we started having themes with one another. Oh, I'm so worked up. And then there's the air I breathe, and one we're both excited about, Be Kind, Rewind. <laughs> about two guys who work in a VHS, the real kind of video shop. And they accidentally erase the videotapes, so they have to refilm the movies. That's great. That it's about time a film like that came out. I'm sure really excited about that. I know, this is like going to be Jack Black's next hit. Yeah, he lost some weight because his hair oh. is blonde now. He's blondie. Oh, jeez. And then there's Meet the Spartans. Woo! You know, first there was date movie, then there was epic movie. Mm. 
and then suddenly it became Meet the Spartans. That was, how is it that Epic Movie ended up on the worst list? I thought that was good. I don't know. I mean, a date movie was bad, but Epic Movie was pretty cool. And then there's a movie called Rambo. You know, that the sounds... 60 year old Sylvester Stallone. Let me laugh at my sleeve! Well, he's the original Rambo, why can't he do it again? He's too old! 60 year olds don't go out with guns and go, We are gonna kill you. You know how every Rambo talks. How does he talk? Like... How's Sylvester Stallone's talk? Something like this. I don't think that's how he talks. Yeah, I'm sort of like, you know, do a favor for and Rambo? And this one, I thought it said speed at first. It's called Seed. Seed? And then there's the Untraceable. I think that's about that website. How, are we, the, how are we going to find that if we can't trace it? It's about that website, and then if you log in, it kills a guy. Because, you know, it has things attached to his wiener. And you push the button and it goes, Argh! have you seen that one? I think so. So we better not go on the internet then. And then there's one January to be announced movie. You two in 3D. What, that band you two in 3D? No, it's the cover band in 3Ds. Why would they need a cover band? Because they're so busy helping the worlds that they can't be everywhere at once. And how can a band be 3D? People are not 3D. 3Ds are movies when you use those type of glasses. Maybe they put them on a screen and you can watch them on screen in 3D. I don't think people watch bands in 3D. Well, I mean, they could. So. Well, well, everyone's already in 3D, you know. Well, that was all we had to say for this month. You have anything to add? Well, January's not usually a big month for films, is it? No, it's usually a pretty, pretty crappy one. Well, there's a few good films. Yeah, there's good ones, though. A few. So what do you want to do? Mmm. I don't know. Go get ready for the new year to come, I guess. But if this is in January, the new year's already come. Oh, yeah. But we're filming this in December. Yeah, it's actually, we always do the Well, let's just say Happy New Year. Happy, Happy New Year already. already. Well, it's not time yet. Let's go, Mark. Hmm. Well, truthfully, after 1995, every other year just seemed the same to us. So, in our hearts, it'll always be 1980-something. So, catch you next time. I did, not, I did not do that. Yes, you did. You fired on camera.